Somebody else painted a picture of you online and they post it a million times and a million people see it and they're like, oh, this is who they are. But then you chill out. It's like, wait, this was just one post. Let me just say this, homie. My, girl, and made oh, my, my, my little mama finna get mad at me, homie. Uh, but it's two women who I swear up and down is straight up hoes I can't stand. And it was Sukiana and, and, and Sexy Red. <laughs> but I was just in a movie with Sukiana. Okay. And, and, and I sat back and I watched her. And 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 in the short time I was around her, I st I studied her actions and her her, her mannerisms. Uh, mm -hmm. That's probably one of the most respectful young ladies I have seen in a long time. Ah, uh, okay. It's fucked up that I is it fucked up that I got that sense from her? I feel like she was just like a genuine cool chick. Homie, or, she's so respectful and mannerable. Her mannerisms, crazy. Uh, her voice tone. Uh, she seems compass. She got a compassionate like spirit. Uh, because. Man, there were some people who didn't want me in the movie, right? Because the, the industry hadn't embraced me yet, right? Uh, but there are some people in the industry uh, who've done their research, uh, and they said, man, the guy really is not what we think. So Whoa. they put me in this movie, right? Uh, me and Sukiyana came up to me probably, what, third, fourth day filming, and she was saying, uh, man, we all were so happy that, that, that you was going to be in the movie. That's fine. Homie, that nigga, I ain't, ne I ain't never felt like love, homie. Yeah. So, so she don't know I've been studying, just watching her, trying mm -hmm. to see if she really, her mannerisms. Homie, listen, I, I fuck with hoes. I know hoes. Nigga, I, I, I grew up around women and ladies, but I had an uncle who was a pimp that kept me around hoes, and they I, they loved them, so I, I got a, so I love hoes. I know how to, I'm like Jesus. I know how to fuck with a hoe. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so I, so, so, so I, I know whole mannerisms. I know whole behavior, mm -hmm. and I know how to look at it. And, and what, what she's singing and rapping, that spirit don't reside in her. I got to see it up close and personal. So now, nah, so what you saying is, uh, yeah, homie, I was wrong about her. Mm -hmm. wow. Yeah, yeah, and I won't apologize to Sookie. And I ain't saying shit about Sexy Red. I ain't <laughs> yeah, I, I yeah, was like, wait, were you wrong yeah, about yeah. Sexy Red? No, nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I won't apologize to Miss Sookie on That's fire. That's fire. It's good y'all got to meet. Y'all got to link. Yeah, homie. Because she probably checked you out. That's why it took three days. Make uh, sure what's up with the movie? Oh uh, well, homie. Uh, see, I wasn't on the set, so 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 if you see in the movie, I came in toward the end. Okay. So they had already been filming. Okay. Uh, I, I came in toward the end of the movie, but it was still like two two days, two or three days uh, 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 of my filming, so. and it was long. Man, that shit hard work, homie. That's all yeah. I'm gonna say. Man, shooting the movie hard. It Is looked that easy. your first like? Oh, uh, that's my set, first. That's right? my first real film. I think you got some more to come too, though. Well, uh, when I leave you guys, uh, I'm shooting a movie. I, I don't know if I can say it, but I'm shooting a movie with uh, me, Amaretta, and, oh, fine, and, and, oh, and, and and I think Saucy might be in it. I'm, I'm not. Oh, I, I, I can't listen. <laughs> when, 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 when we done our reading, uh, there was a there was a there was a uh, there was a gay what? black. There was a gay. There, there was a gay <laughs> black male. Got me lost. When when we all introduced ourselves. Uh, he introduced this, and the reason I don't remember the name, because uh, he specifically highlighted, and I'm a gay black male. <laughs> Wait, so how did this happen? Well, we're, we're, was we're doing, it through a phone? Uh, or, well, we're, right, all, we're, all on, we're, all on, we're all on a video chat okay, okay. Uh, doing, doing, cool. doing, doing our line readings for, yeah. for the movie scene, right? To make sure we're... Re re Remember on the lines mm -hmm. and all Check that the shit. Time Yo, is. Charles yeah. and White and Saucy Santana. Oh uh, no, no, no. So, so, this, so, so, don't, I don't correct, don't, don't, don't say that. I'm just saying, like, it's I, just I, a mad. I'm just saying, there's a, there's a, there's a gay black male that's in the movie. I, I, I the voice was real flamboyant. It sounds like it. So, I can't Ooh. remember the name. Ooh, okay. But it's, it's, it's a movie about uh, Atlanta's Freak Nick, right? Oh, in, in the early '90s, and, and, and I forgot. Uh, it's about the Freak Nick. And, and, and I play I play the character of, of, of a role by the name of a guy by the name of Black, a uh, gangster nigga, killer nigga with goals in his mouth, and he hate and he hate funks, he hate homosexuals. <laughs> oh, Lord. Because, right, we got enough. We got enough. Uh, don't well, give, well, don't well, give it all. No, no. Well, well, it all? Uh, uh, well, because it's the freak nick era, right? Yeah, 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 so yeah. there was a time you, you have to think gays migrated. There, there, there was a great migration to Atlanta of homosexuals. Migration. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, it just came. Sorry. There yeah, yeah. So, 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 yeah, so, chill out. That should be like, yeah, y'all boys love it. So, so, I want, I want to say this, homie, because I'm gonna go film this movie. So, I, I, so, 
<laughs> I, I'm not hateful, right? Even though, I'm even about, though, even though, even though I disagree, disagree with the homosexual what's, what's, lifestyle, I'm not hateful, right? Uh, oh shit! But my character hates gays, right? right. So, close. so black hates. Walk that line. So, so black hates gays, and in the movie, in these characters, you have to tap. That's why they call acting witchcraft, homie, because you have to tap you into it. Channel this. it. You have to channel this. Yep. So when when so so. This character is, he upset because you got all these fine bitches around here, but now gays are now starting to come to Atlanta. They got gay clubs. So he mad about Atlanta changing into gays, and it's the freak nick. So he don't give a damn about the freak nick. Uh, he finna start killing and shooting the gays. Oh, shit. Uh, so I have to tap into, into that nature and into that character. Yeah. And, and, and what I learned, homie, that is that uh, as much as I disagree with it, I don't hate it, and I don't hate them because I I couldn't mm. tap into I couldn't channel it yeah. during, during the reading. I see, I see. But so so. But I, just so you know, the headline will be Charles and White kills gays. Oh, uh, you well, know what I mean? Uh, like, what, 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 that's, it, that's it, what the a, highlight will be. That's what they'll a, try to make uh, it about it. What, what, it. It's great production, so it, it won't be. So it, the movie, uh, it, it's a real big, big movie and film. Uh, so that's that's where. That's where your acting coaches come in. Mm. So, so just think about the, the the guys who have to play the role that they molesting the kid. Yeah. Uh, think about the guys who who have to play the role as if they get raped in prison. Uh, the facial expressions. Uh, you have to go. What? You gotta fuck? go there. You gotta. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta go, there. go there, homie. To really sell it, it on it, camera. It, and it, you it, gotta... Now, now, if, if you if, if you don't want to go there, then you go on Tubi. <laughs> but if you want to get in the real yeah, acting, yeah, homie, it's true, true, yeah, Shout nigga. Out to Tubi. So that's why you know it's that. So that's why in some movies they got to do some real fucking. Yeah. Yep. Nigga, that white boy got to fuck a uh, uh, Holly Berry in that film. She uh, won that Oscar Monster in Monster Ball. Ball. Monster he got to get in that put yeah, because better. because if you want to, Yo, could you, you imagine the sign up sheet for it though? Yes. <laughs> Oh uh, yes, uh, you know what I mean. Signature, yes. Oh uh, well, she's the co-star. He was the main star. She had to right. submit. He didn't. Yeah, he, I know. He, yeah, yeah. I'm awesome. just saying he was happy. Well, let me just say this. Uh, uh, he get to pick who he want to fuck in this movie. When you that big, mm-hmm. when you Brad Pitt and, and and you uh, what's that other motherfucker name? Uh, they uh, prayed the pa- uh, Tom Cruise. Uh, no, nah, on the Titanic. The other one. Leonardo. Leonardo DiCaprio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get to pick who you get to fucking kiss on in these movies. Cause, <laughs> because, because naturally, y'all are going to shoot this film for six to nine months. And those are and the ultimate pimps, right? Come on, man. Them joint Gotta make it look real. You, well, uh, let me get her. Let me get her. Uh, the, well, it, the movie producer is the ultimate pimp, not the actor. Word. Because he get to fuck both of them if he want to, the movie producer. Yeah. <laughs> That's facts. The actor's just the talent. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. the Harvey Weinstein. Uh, th- that's why Weinstein. I said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah now Harvey gonna invite you to the office, nigga, and he in the shower naked, jacking off while y'all reading the movie scene. <laughs> yeah. He was a motherfucker. I didn't expect you so soon. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but this is what I learned, homie. Uh, uh, that shit is hard work. Mm-hmm. And, and, and it's pressure on those people. And 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 it's hard to it's hard to maintain this light. And and and, and it's hard to maintain your sanity, uh, your morals, yeah. with a sober mind. Right. How how long do you have to prep for these roles? Because uh, however long that prep is could be detrimental in the sense that you gotta uh, channel that character. Uh well for 30, 60, 90 days. Yeah, man, well some some people film for six to nine months, homie. And so yep. nigga, uh what what ends up happening is uh while you're challenging that, some of these traits are, are displayed in your behavior with your woman at home. Mm. With your home with, with your homeboys, with yeah, your homeboys yeah. at the bar at the car wash. Start, uh, yeah. you, you can't play Dunny Brasco for nine months and then turn it off because you have to go be around gangsters. You talk to this person. You learn about this. So you learn so much to try to take on the, what you think the yeah, nature You're almost of, naturally adapting that behavior. Uh, you're occasions. you're becoming possessed. Yeah. The perfect example, unfortunately, and fortunately for us, I guess, was Heath Ledger, right? Yeah. Joker? Uh, well, that's why, that's, why, that's why the religious world say that acting and, and all of this is a form of witchcraft and you have to take on, put, you have, you, it's like you're being possessed. Yes. Who was it? Wasn't it like Jim Carrey that had a, a big problem with that? I'm sure. Yeah. Because he's done some out there movies. Yeah, they, like he Truman said like he can't even leave the character. 
Uh, well, you, I think you, I'm pretty sure uh, if you look at his Jim Carrey, he did some wild well, shit. Well, well, that's that's why you guys are good for rappers because you 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 allow them to leave the characters. Yeah. 